We will now begin the press, regular press conference by Foreign Minister Hayashi. Over to you, sir, Minister. So first, at the outset, uh, I'd like to talk about uh, North Korea and uh, the launch of a missile. North Korea at North Korea at 7.25, uh, around 7.25 on the 11th today, launched what is possibly a ballistic missile from the inland of North Korea, at least once uh, toward the east. With regard to the details, uh, we are still analyzing, but uh, inclusive of the repeated launching of uh, ballistic missiles, uh, the series of uh, behavior by North Korea poses a threat to the peace and security of Japan and the region and the international community. We strongly condemn this. On the 7th, we had the Japan-US uh, 2 plus 2, including uh, the concerning uh, the uh, ish launch of the missile by North Korea and the 5th, and uh, the activities by North Korea related to nuclear and missiles. Uh, strong concerns uh, were shared, and uh, we saw complete concurrence between the United States and Japan regarding a uh, total uh, the denuclearization uh, uh, based on uh, UNSC resolutions. Uh, uh, many countries are condemning the activities of uh, North Korea. This morning, Japan time in New York, uh, uh, UNSC met regarding uh, the f uh, missile launch on the 5th. And uh, it is uh, extremely regrettable that uh, North Korea continues to launch missiles amidst uh, this situation. Going forward between Japan and the United States, Japan, United States, and South Korea, we will closely liaise and uh, we will cooperate with the international community. Uh, we will uh, work toward uh, moving forward with the complete implementation of UNFC resolutions and uh, we will work toward complete uh, denuclearization of uh, North Korea. If you have a question, uh, please proceed to the microphone and state your name and affiliation before you state your question. Abe from Yomiuri on uh, North Korea and the, what is a, seen to be a missile, a projectile launched by North Korea. And uh, following on last week, uh, they repeatedly continue to launch. Uh, through uh, diplomatic uh, routes, have you uh, protested on uh, this uh, most recent launch. With regard to the details of uh, this launch, uh, we are still uh, analyzing at present. Uh, based on uh, the collection of information and results of an analysis, uh, we would like to uh, respond appropriately. Next question, please. Mickey from UK. With Regards to this question, in the Foreign Affairs Committee of the LDP, based on the multiple uh, launches of a missile by North Korea, uh, there was a need. Uh, it was pointed out that there is a need to consider holding uh, enemy base attack capability. What are your, your thoughts with regards to the enemy attack capabilities? So I would like to refrain from commenting on this uh, party's uh, committee's uh, comment. However, we will look into every option. Uh, that is the direction given by the prime minister. So I would like to collaborate with the various ministries and agencies. Thank you. Next question, please. No further questions? Please go ahead. Higuchi. In the morning, uh, there was a uh, conference uh, with uh, the Prime Minister, a, a media scrum, and uh, in the U.S. base, uh, there's an increase in spread of uh, COVID-19. Japan, U.S. Uh, U.S. Uh, FJ uh, forces stationed in Japan, uh, it was mentioned that uh, proper discussions would take place between Japan and the U.S. at the Joint Committee. Uh, but uh, what is mentioned is uh, that uh, the quarantine testing is not in accordance uh, with uh, the rules uh, and the restrictions on uh, uh, movement uh, has been issued, uh, uh, but uh, it is uh, not uh, thoroughly uh, implemented. Uh, so what are the present issues? And the spread is uh, still uh, increasing rapidly, and I believe that uh, discussions are imminent. Uh, so what is the timing uh, and the schedule you have in mind at the moment? Uh, as you mentioned uh, earlier, uh, the Prime Minister, uh, with regard to the uh, uh, health and hygiene issues, uh, 
uh, there was instructions to properly discuss between Japan and the U.S. at the Joint Committee based on SOFA. So uh, based on this, uh, uh, the recent uh, statement uh, is such that uh, Japan and the U.S. Uh, under the Joint uh, Committee uh, will uh, work to respond to minimize the spread of infections of uh, COVID-19 and as necessary will uh, uh, share the necessary information and with regard to additional measures, uh, close uh, consultations uh, uh, will take place uh, through cooperation and on the part of the government based on the statement uh, between Japan US authorities uh, through constructive uh, consultations. Uh, we will keep a uh, close eye on the spread of the uh, infection uh, toward the uh, prevention of uh, the infection and alleviating concerns of the local committee uh, regarding issues of health and hygiene. Uh, we will further step up uh, cooperation between Japan and the US. Uh, we would like to uh, move with a sense of urgency. Please continue. Thank you. So you said to act with speed, uh, but in terms of uh, the concrete challenges, for example, uh, the testing capabilities or different uh, issues, you will be discussing these concrete measures as well. So uh, at the risk of repeating myself, I would like to uh, say that uh, in order to minimize the spread of COVID-19, testing uh, pre-departure as well as at the arrival stage. We have uh, conducted uh, various communications and uh, shared relevant information, which led to this uh, joint statement. So uh, inclusive of what you mentioned, we will uh, continue the discussions uh, to enhance measures. Next question, please. Salai-san, please. TV Asahi Sawai is my name. On the other hand, a related question, uh, the opposition uh, Constitutional Democratic Party leader, Mr. Izumi, said that uh, uh, the SOFA should be reviewed so that the quarantine conditions should be the same as uh, with uh, Japan. And uh, the party has uh, expressed its intention to ask for revision of uh, SOFA in the uh, ordinary session of the Diet. I think that will be the center of discussion. And uh, you have uh, always said that there's no, it's not necessary to revise SOFA. Could you state the reasons uh, why? On the part of the uh, government, uh, Japan-US uh, uh, SOFA agreement uh, revision is not uh, what we are contemplating. And I have always said that. Having said that, based on instructions from the Prime Minister, as uh, you have mentioned, uh, USFG uh, stationing uh, health and uh, hygiene issues uh, based on this at the Joint uh, Committee uh, uh, of Japan and the U.S. based on SOFA, uh, prevention of spread and alleviation of anxiety of the local community. Uh, toward this end, uh, we will further strengthen uh, cooperation between Japan and the United States. Uh, with regard to SOFA, it is a uh, large uh, legal framework which include uh, the agreed uh, minutes uh, of uh, the agreement. So uh, based, depending on the incident, uh, uh, we will take the most appropriate measure which will enable us to be most effective and most agile. And uh, we have always uh, approached uh, individual uh, specific issues uh, in this way uh, con concerning this incident so that uh, local uh, anxiety can be alleviated as, and through close cooperation between Japan and the United States so we will be uh, nimble and appropriate uh, and uh, we will uh, would like to approach uh, the issue so that we can be thorough with regard to prevention and infection uh, of uh, COVID-19. The next question please, Asahi Shimbun, Nobita. With regards to the lower house number of members, in Yamaguchi Prefecture, the number of seats will be reduced by one. And uh, there has been uh, criticism that uh, the local voice will not be heard uh, in the national government. What are your thoughts? Uh, the party, the LDP, is having various discussions with regards to the number of seats. Uh, but uh, this is not uh, under the foreign ministry. Uh, therefore, I would like to refrain from commenting. Aoki-san, please. NHK Aoki. On uh, COVID-19 uh, border measures, uh, uh, it was uh, uh, stated yesterday it would be continued uh, f until, the, uh, uh, until the end of uh, 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 February. Uh, but uh, there have been um, um, points mentioned with regard to uh, humanitarian and national interest uh, cases. Uh, so would you uh, would elaborate on this, please? 
This morning, uh, the Prime Minister commented in the interview that the government will continue the current uh, framework of measures with regards to border control uh, until the end of February while taking the necessary response in light of humanitarian and national interest perspectives. We have uh, made humanitarian considerations uh, in the past uh, with regards to individual situations and taking the necessary quarantine measures to allow entry. So we will continue to take into account the individual situations to take uh, appropriate measures. Any other question? No further questions? Then we'd like to conclude at this point. Thank you very much.